Dr. Neil Naranjo spent his childhood as he says most East Texans do. Well, like any East Texas kid, I was always picking up arrowheads uh, everywhere you saw them laying on the ground. That excitement of discovery never dimmed in Dr. Naranjo. He went on to study anthropology and archaeology in college. Although he and his wife Mary Ann co-own Piney Woods Home Health Care, he spends his free time leasing land in Montana, digging up dinosaur bones. Like people here will lease a rancher's land to go deer hunting up there. You can and release it to go dinosaur bone hunting. Storage has become a problem after decades of bringing home dino bones. Between his wife's threats... If you don't get these off my dining room table, I'm going to make some caveman soup. And a family friend's suggestion, he got the answer. She said, you need to have a museum, you need to have a museum. It's this lot next door to his home health care business that Dr. Neil Naranjo plans to build his 10,000 square foot science museum. He says it will have the Houston Museum of Natural Science beat for two reasons. One, I'm going to have more skeletons. Two, I'm going to do dioramas. He's passionate about East Texan kids getting up close and personal with his dinosaur bones and accurate depictions of their habitats. If I pull it off uh, correctly, uh, there, there ought to be a lot of wow. That's what he's most excited about, seeing the reactions from people when the museum's doors finally open, which he believes could be within a couple of years. In Lufkin, Morgan Thomas, East Texas News.